first thing I'm going to do with this video, this video is uh, I'm going to show you the motherboard. I'm going to unbox it. And in case you're curious, let me get the box. Okay. That was probably weird. Like I am. It's a gigabyte. N68M-S2P. I think you can probably read that. But anyway, it's not the fanciest motherboard. It's just a cheaper $60 motherboard, but it's for a computer that's getting on the verge of being three years already. So no point in spending a fortune for it. And besides, it's for grandma. It's not a gaming computer. So don't need highest end motherboard in the world. It's got enough on it to work in sort of purpose. Um, it only had two DDR2 memory slots on it, etc. Etc. It does have a three year warranty. Certainly, I think this is going to be a more reliable board than that ASUS board that was in it previously. Um, so, what the motherboard's job is to do is um, this will probably put it in the easiest perspective. Um, it basically serves as like the streets and highways do here in a city or anywhere. Um, it allows, it enables you to have transportation and go from place to place. And that's kind of what the motherboard does. Every component in your computer will connect to it either directly or indirectly. And it, without, it's the main circuit. Without it, you have nothing. You can't turn your computer on. You'll have no display, no keyboard, no mouse. Uh, no nothing. Absolutely nothing. So, motherboard is an important part. It's the, probably one of the most important parts. Now you have a cat in the way. So anyway, I'm going to show you the uh, motherboard. And we will go from there. Enjoy. Okay, I'm going to pull out the motherboard here. And you're going to see a an item in my hand here. This is an anti-static wrist strap. Very important when you're working on a computer that you have one of these. Computer parts do not like to be uh, touched with static electricity. You can ruin parts that way. So what you do is you saw that a moment ago an alligator clip on that. You'll clip it to any of the metallic parts of the case of the computer that will ground yourself to keep you from shocking. Make sure that the wrist strap is of course firmly around your wrist. Not to the point where it's suffocating your wrist or anything. Okay, now showing you the motherboard box which you've seen already. And I'm, un and I'm unboxing it. There's manual, very important. You will need the manual a lot of times. And I believe there's also a disc in there as well, which will have a lot of drivers and such. Those are some of your connectors, your SATA connector and your PADA connector. That's the I.O. shield. That goes in the back of the computer where all your plug or ports are at. Now here's the motherboard. This motherboard has onboard video on it. However, we are going to still throw in a video card. <coughs> and it's in an anti static bag, which most electronics like this are. And I'm going to cut the bag open because it was taped shut. And I'm going to pull the motherboard out. And I'm going to set it on the anti-static bag for now. Now I'm just surveying the board. <laughs> 